Hello traders, John at StockBookie.com. Today we're looking at AMD on the daily weekly time frames using technical analysis here at StockBookie.com. If you like these videos, go to my website, sign up, or click down here in the lower right hand corner and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Alright guys, so AMD, daily chart, 40 cents down, flat after hours, 78 million shares traded, 1.52% in the red. So we got above the channel, Google News guys, AI using all their chips. Boom, hits 27, 27, 28 even number. This high pivot, big resistance here, guys. Markets pull back. Guess what? AMD is pulling back. Market would have stayed strong. We would have probably got some follow through here as well. We did not. So we came right back in, right into this channel. But we're holding this green bar here. On the daily chart, as long as we hold 2571-ish area, we'll be fine. If we close below that and then start uh, hitting this pivot low around 25.33, then 25, we'll most likely be going down to the $24 area or the 20 MA with the bottom of this bar. And we still have a gap fill here at 23.22. All right, bulls, you want to stay up here. Just keep consolidating. Maybe into earnings. Maybe we make a run into earnings. If we try to do that, we now we need to get above this. Let's just put... Uh, you know, symmetry is not that great. All right, hold on here. Let's just put it across. So that's the high pivot there. And then at least we'll have some numbers. So 28.13, 28.49, all right? We get above those pivots, make a run for 30, close above it, then we'd probably be going to double top, all right? But we got to make, this is one of those just like this move, guys. Once they get it going, they got to keep it rolling, all right? If we do start to slide, you're watching that 20... <sighs> 25 75 number then the 25 even number if those start to break then you're going to watch where these moving averages are if we get through all this congestion of support gap fill 618 750 all the moving averages trend line if we get through that guys we're going back to 1611 if we stay up in this area we might just end up chopping around above the ma's all right still in a bullish stance a little bit stretched on the daily we'll see what it gives us tomorrow and the rest of the week um, here's another look on the weekly chart, guys. We're right back. On the weekly, we closed right on that trend line. Now we're coming back in or staying below it. So still slightly bullish up and sideways, but into some really good resistance where we're going to need a big gap up possibly to get this thing going. Or does it take the path of least resistance and, and start to fade here? If it fades again, um, gosh, on this one, let's see, 2172. Yeah, 23 bucks. You know, you still have 25 quarter number, 24 um, all the way down, coming into support, going up. You have the big area with the pivot, uh, the 30 even number, the 750. You have the 618. So let's get this one or give this one a little, a uh, little more time, see what direction it can possibly go. But it had a nice pullback off this uh, area here. Boom, boom, two days. A little follow through on this candle. But I needed to close below this and this one, and then we could possibly see a little more dumping. We'll stick a short-term retrace from here to here. See, well, you know what? Let's do that right now. Let's see if it comes down a little bit more. Let's go out a little bit further so we know it's this one. We're just going to go to the top here see where we're at. All right, so we almost came in at 382. Uh, the 250 retrace, we did close below, so we'll have to see. So 25.43, 24.59, and uh, this area will be big down here right here, 23.81. To 23 bucks 22.95 too with the 50 ma hmm that's more short-term stuff guys you know looking at these numbers here all right a little bit bigger of a retrace comes over on this side a little bit tighter one on on this side so um still all right still back in the range let's see what happens do we go right back down to the bottom if we do that guys if we go right back down i think we're cracking and we're going we have some gaps to fill of course but um my position will be done if we're hitting these 19 bucks uh, $17, I'll be out by that time. So, all right, guys, AMD, um, if you like these videos, don't forget to subscribe. Um, thanks again for watching. I really do appreciate it. God bless. See you on the charts.